welcome to the vlog, guys. <laughs> fucking hell. I don't know if you can hear me, but you're looking absolutely fucking splendid today. Yeah, please don't judge me for that fucking deadlift. I wasn't meant to do it, but <laughs> before we continue with this vlog, I guess we should uh, cue the intro. Looks good. Guys, you might be wondering why are you wearing a different t-shirt to like the last sort of scene of this vlog. It is now fucking nearly half past ten at night. I just finished my shift. Basically, oh Jesus Christ. Basically, I uh, did that whole training session. It was really, it was, no, nah, it wasn't really good. I was very rushed for time because I had to start my shift earlier than usual. And as a result of that, I wasn't able to do the arms portion of my back workout. So I'm going to do that now after my shift. So I've literally just I trained for like an hour, and, well, it was two hours, done a 10 hour shift. And now we're gonna, gonna get, a, get a pump, boys. Fucking, ah, oh, let's go. I'm so tired though. I'm gonna show you those clips from the earlier training session. It's a bit lackluster, like I know I was in a rush and I was just trying to get things done, so anyways, yeah. But we're gonna fucking get some fucking blood in these arms. Fucking massive, Jesus. Whew. I have a sweat on just from those dumbbell curls, man. Uh, I'm hoping that, like, you guys can't hear the music in the background because I don't want YouTube to copyright me, but <laughs> whatever. Whew. Long ass day, man. I'm tired as a motherfucker. No place I'd rather be other than Taco Bell McDonald's on my bed. Right, we want some triceps. Forty on next. I'm hoping that's gonna be a warm up and that maybe I can fuck around and try. There we go. Try sixty. But we'll uh, we'll see. We'll see. Wish I had someone to like pan the camera up and down. But it's alright until I die. There we go. I really hope this fucking rope doesn't snap on me. trying 60 then boys <laughs> Fucking hell. I actually just did like 25 28 dips with my body weight and then had like a little rant at you guys about not doing the rest of this session because like I was only meant to do two fucking arm exercises this morning so why am I doing four now that's dumb and it's late and I want to go to bed it's been a long ass day so yeah and then I checked the camera and it wasn't recording so yeah I'm a cunt do what I want in it yeah so I'm a I'm a cool today here. I'm gonna continue the vlog tomorrow because I'm a tired, tired boy. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. It is the day after, the day after the next day. No, 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 that's not right. It's the day after next day, the next day. Basically, I didn't vlog yesterday. Just a little cock up on my end. I had things to do. It was a rest day, so it would have been boring anyway for you guys, although I'm sure my normal days are pretty boring for you guys. I didn't really do much. I had to spend some time editing a vlog for a friend. Oh, I received this uh, this underwear to, to, to try on. Basically, I've got to go and do a shoot in it at Flamborough on Saturday for this company that I've started doing some content for. Like, they've liked the content I've done so far so much that they want me to do, like, actual sort of, like, Instagram promotional content for them as well. So that's cool, I'll pop their Instagram up here. I had a date, but yeah, you guys don't really want to hear about that. It was just I ate, nothing special, but not too bad either, I enjoyed myself. Oh yeah, this is the big news. 
Got my brand new blue passport. Beautiful new blue passport. But it's black, so Boris lied to me there. Bastard. So I'm I'm a booker book a holiday. As for what we're doing today, I'm actually gonna go train at a different gym to Ultra. And it's this gym, workout. Uh, which is another gym here in Hull. And it's a pretty good gym. It's not ultra, but it's pretty good. I'm just going to go there because they've got some different leg kit and it's leg day. So I thought I'd fuck around and try it. I should mention, if you guys can't hear me very well, it's because my fucking microphone is on its last legs in terms of battery. So I need to go pick up a new battery for that. But yeah, now I'll go see you guys in the gym. And I'm done. Finished the session. Pretty decent. Can't complain. Ah, I'm a stick, you guys. Yeah. Stay there. Yeah, that works. Yeah, pretty decent session at workout. Uh, first time I've trained here in like nearly a fucking year. I've just trained here for the sake of trying something different. Obviously there's nothing wrong with Ultra Ultra. It's like literally the best gym in the North and probably top three in the whole of the UK. But yeah, no, I'm in a little bit of change. Plus I'm on shift later and sometimes being there for like 10 to 12 hours straight really does just zap me a little bit. So at least now I've got some time to go home, get changed stuff like that and not also when I train at ultra I end up doing shift things as well because people just you know recognize you as working there but anyways really good session you'll be seeing some clips I don't know you know what I'll just fucking talk over them uh started off with a single leg hamstring curl today was meant to be my hamstring focused leg session so I did those single leg hamstring curls they were really really good I really like the, the bit of kit we've got in here that they've got in here it's very similar to the one that I used at York the other day the Atlantis one which I really really liked um I was then meant to do RDLs, but I didn't bring any straps and the bars here are just too thick for me to hold on to, so I got up to 140 and then just sat them off and decided to just play around and try all the other bits of kit. So after those RDL, like after I sat them, sacked off those RDLs, I moved on to uh, the Cybex squat press, which I fucking love. Love that Cybex squat press. And then, yeah, I think I did something like 450 for 11 as a top set and 380 for 16 as a back off. Probably had a little bit more on me, in me, sorry, on both of those sets, but I didn't have a spot and I didn't want to fucking risk, risk dying, to be honest. Uh, back, uh, finish, sorry, moving on from that, we hit uh, a seated hamstring curl. Not too bad, pretty pretty basic, really. Um, that one's a little bit harder than the one we, one we have at Ultra, which is a hammer strength one. Their one is, I don't even know what brand that was, but yeah, did two sets on there. Oh, did two sets on everything, actually. Then moved on to uh, hip adduction. Basically mounted nearly the whole stack. Then we tried. I tried the high, the Cybex hack squat. Got humbled by four plates aside. Only got six reps. Probably had more in me, but like I've been having some slight knee issues. And it doesn't help that I keep on fucking bumping into shit. Like I'm gonna throw a clip somewhere of me walking into a subwoofer whilst closing up at Ultra the other night. And uh, yeah, then I also fucking keep on kneeing things by accident or hitting myself in the knee with equipment. And it's fucking ruining me because like they're already tender and then they get bruised as well um <laughs> then after that cybex work uh sorry after the hack squat work we finished off with some seated calf raises which again i fucking hit my knee on somehow but yeah really really good really good session took my top off and posed a little bit but yeah <laughs> that's pretty much pretty much all there is to talk about that session no complaints I'm gonna pop my top off now because it is soaking and I don't really want to sit in it as a drive. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna head home, eat really quick, shower, and then start today's shift. Woohoo! A little bit of a short one, seven till ten today, so hopefully I won't be too shattered, but I probably will. See you guys now. What's up? Fucking focus. Yeah. Focus! There we go. Yeah, pretty sad that's focused. Um, I'm eating, <laughs> post-workout, I'm literally having beans and tuna, I haven't even fucking heated it up, literally just poured the beans straight from the can and mixed it with the tuna, I just CBA, I'm too tired, I'm a, I'm a scoff this, I think this is like 38 grams of protein, no, 18, it's like 46 grams of protein, so I'm going to eat this and yeah, see you guys, no, 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 I'm not going to see you guys at the gym, am I? I'm gonna, we've just been at the gym. I yeah, yeah. need to get dressed, so uh, let's put some clothes on. There we go, dressed. Uh, I'm gonna head over to work now. Running a little bit late, and my homies asked me to pick up some stuff for the shift, so I'm 
I'm going to do that and not blog any of this because otherwise I'm not going to get shit done on time. So yeah, I'll see you whenever, see you guys whenever I next see you, whatever clip that's going to be. Ooh, the mystery, the mystery. Ugh. Good morning guys, or like good afternoon. It is again the next day. Uh, I didn't really vlog much, well I didn't vlog at all after I said goodbye to you guys yesterday because I went on shift and then I just had loads of stuff to do whilst I was doing that. Yeah, and then after the shift, I actually had a day which was really, really, really fucking good. And obviously I wasn't gonna vlog through that. But I'm not gonna take you guys through my day today. This is actually the outro of this video. Oh, one thing to note is I did actually have a consultation call with a potential coach this morning, which was quite good. He seems really, really, really knowledgeable. Really, like, I like the stuff he posts on social media and yeah, he seems, seems good, he's done well with himself, so yeah, look forward to potentially working with him. In case you're wondering why I would get a coach, like, I know how to train myself and I know how to eat myself, like, I, I lost 15 kilos you know, on my own, you saw all those other videos, so yeah, I'm completely competent on my own, but I'm a lot more accountable when I have someone to report to, so whether that be in terms of how good I am with my recovery or food quality or you know training intensity volume everything like that I'll be a lot more accountable with if I have somebody else to t somebody that I have to report to and tell these things and almost it's like almost a shame factor we were talking about like if I feel ashamed about having to tell someone about the, something I'm less likely to do it and that'll be better for my progress but anyways fingers crossed you guys have enjoyed this video as always I've enjoyed making it if you did enjoy it then like leave a like subscribe for more content like this if you didn't enjoy it then leave a comment tell me i'm a bell end you can do that if you did enjoy it as well i don't mind mm -hmm. yeah go follow my instagram it's in the link in the bio and i will see you guys in the next damn video